Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenra, and today we are playing as the Manchu here in the Open Rosalis 4. It's the year 1507, and this is what this is what parts of the world that we can see. We can see the Mamluks over here, who have a couple of vassals, Hasa and Najd. Persia over here, allied with the Ottomans. They're going to be a force to reckon with. I'm surprised neither of them have the Timurids as a rival. It's kind of odd. But, um... I guess the Timurids and Mamluks are kind of... No, they're not. It's a weird little love triangle they have here. I guess the Ottomans and the Timurids might get together, which would make Persia, Ottomans, Timurids a very, very, very potent enemy if we ever had to go to war with them. But we're trying to improve relations at the moment. I'm just not sure if there's anything much we can do about it. I'm going to set the Mamluks as a rival, because we don't really have any freaking rivals. And hopefully that'll get the Timurids to like us a little bit more. I'm not sure, though. They do border us, and they do hate us, and they do—they are in the coalition against us for whatever reason. But I don't know. Maybe we can improve relations. Who knows? Let's move forward. The colony is almost done in Tunguska. Please to be hurrying up so I can move on. Moscow is also almost done with their colony. I would like to get to Surgut. If I could get to Surgut before Moscow does, that would make me very happy. Come on, you stupid colony. Stupid colony. And we're almost done next in Shun. Good. I don't need Shun. Uh-oh. My vassal has peasant rebels. Uh, where's your army, Ming? Ming? That's Chagtai's army. Where's Ming's army? Oh, they're up here. Alright. Boom, uh, boom, boom. Yeah, let's throw no guy in there. No guy. Perfect. Get relations up with the Oirats a little bit. And who else can we improve relations with? We've done the Timurids all the way up to 100, and they still don't like us. Hmm. Try supporting rebels. Mongol patriots. Uh, not sure if that's worth doing. The Timurids have positive stability, which is really awkward. You know what? Yeah, support rebels. We're gonna get caught, but whatever. All right, colony is done. Core it, and he's almost done over there. We're gonna move on. And Shun has integrated. Yay! One less relationship that we have to worry worry about. So we're down to four. We can have two more relationships now. Alrighty then. Ming is over here beating up uh, Shan's army. That's nice. I approve, I guess. Nepal, Takeda, Gujarat, and Oirat. All right. If you would just leave that coalition, I'd be so happy. And we got discovered in the Timurids, yeah. Oh, well. What else can we do here? Um... Wow. Orissa completely annexed Bengal. That's... Wow. And Vagina Gar is up here pushing their shit in. Yeah. Then. Wow. Look at Malwa. Wow. And Delhi's down to what? One province? Ha! Delhi has one province left. Sucks to be you, Delhi. Looks like most people have flipped to um, Hindu. Yeah. There's a couple. No, they've gone Hindu. Hindu. Most people are Hindu. Yeah. All the normal Sunni have flipped to Hindu. Hello, Central Siberia Wasteland. 
Nice to meet you. And Muscovy just finished their colony. Now, where are they going to go? Where are they going to go? Who knows? Oh, he went south. Yay, Muscovy went south. Good. He went down to Tura, so he's leaving the north open for us. Good. I want to steal it if we can. Weird little snaky colony trip, but worth it if we can get this alliance over here. This alliance over here? Not yet. Well, get relations back up, damn it. They're not too far gone. Ooh. Gain money or trade efficiency? Uh, it's a temporary trade efficiency. I'll take the money. Thank you for money. I like money. Ooh, Algeria has a peasant's war. Sucks to be you. We are almost at full manpower. Nice. That would be when I want to go to war with the Timurids, when we have full manpower. Maxed relations with the Oirats, and they still hate our guts. Ugh. Sorry, Oirats. You know how it is, though, right? I mean, it's nothing personal. I just hate you a lot, that's all. National trade income goes down for five years. It's okay. Now this is what we're going to have to keep doing. Since we have Ming in a union, we need to keep killing all their rebels all the time. We just have to. It is our job. It's our job. And Japan. You're never going to get rid of that stupid rivalry. I hate you so much, Japan. You suck. Hmm. I bet we could beat Joe in a couple wars. Hmm. I gotta go colonize Taiwan, though. Which is not in range. Our range is 160, and Taiwan is 166 away. God damn it. But... What tech do we need? Tech 7. So if we get Diplo Tech 7, that'll be enough range. Uh, we can do that, I guess. Okay, max relations with Muscovy. Do you want an alliance yet, Muscovy? No. Man. Still says distance, negative 41. I mean, the distance is closing. But it's still a problem. Hmm. Yeah, give me access. That'll help. Well, it'll help my opinion of him, anyway. And West Tunguska has cord. Good. You build a building for me. Armory, please. Can you please leave this freaking coalition? Please. Timurids. Please. Place to be. Place to be. Not that it matters that much, but I would just prefer not to have to do a coalition war. I don't like coalition wars. Uh, more buildings. Good. Still Regency down there, huh? So he can't declare wars for a while. And then, uh, relations. Relations. Oh, Peasants War on Kara Coinlu. Whoa. Well, that's one thing we could do. If we break our alliance with Tibet... Then we could declare war on Tibet, and Joe would join against us. That's a possibility. And then when Joe's against us, we can um, demand that they give shit to Ming. Das is a good plan, yeah. That's what we'll do. 
That way we don't have to um, border Joe in any way. Although I guess we could. If we um, if we force them to give Lung Zhou to Ming, because Ming has a core here, then we could go get Kam for ourselves. I'm sure it'd be relatively cheap. Go take that, and then we'll have a border with Joe. That'll work. We'll do that. Wow, we actually religiously converted something. But there's no way we can do these. I mean, that's going to take a long, long, long time. Wow. Wow. Yeah, that's not going to happen. But we can do some buildings. Buildings are good. Or cores, maybe. Oh, no. Buildings, then. Buildings, then. Good. Religious unity, relations with the Timurids. I would love to. It's just, you know, shit's not happening. England will cede Calais, Armagnac, and Labord to France. So France has kicked England out of continental Europe. Bye, England. Bye. So Milan, Savoy, and Venice. Hungary, Lithuania, and Oldenburg. Brittany. Oh, Castile did get the Iberian wedding. And Naples is not part of Aragon. They broke free. Hmm. Austria has... Uh, Castile as an ally. They have three vassals. Man, Austria is just a beast. They might even stand up to France successfully, but I doubt it. Nobody stands up to France successfully, at least not for very long. France inherited the throne of Gelray. Who cares? <laughs> we got one province. We're amazing. No, not really. Large revolt. Oof. Three rebels. No way. Three rebels. Are you kidding me? Um, let me put some dudes over there. And um, let me put some more dudes over there. And I'll, I'll... Wow. Large revolt. That just sounds so horrifying. Uh, level one. Whatever's cheap. All right, so that war is over. As soon as we have a diplomat, we can go declare war. Timurids left. Oh, the Timurids left the coalition. Hmm. But he does still have allies. But hey, that means we can declare war on the on Oirat Horde. Get them as a vassal. Hmm. We probably should do that right now. You know, we'll, we'll declare both wars. Why wait? Wealthy neighbors. Get a claim on Ming again. I don't need a claim on Ming. Ming is my bitch. Uh, but yeah, Sean can't join the war against us because, well, we have a truce. So, yeah, let's go for, I don't know, Dorno Govi, whatever. Who wants to join me? Nobody. Okay, I don't care. Uh... Go there. Go there. Go there. Go to Tanatuba. Whatever. We'll figure it out, damn it. Okay, hurry up. Get up there. I got a revolt to kill down. Three rebels. Jesus Christ, so many rebels. Where do they come from? What do they want? You know, these are the questions that need answering. Oh no, they spawned. No, careful. Oh, goodness. Can we handle it? It looks like maybe not. Oh, Christ. Oh, we somehow survived. Wow, that was really rough, though. Alright, come back. I can breathe again. Uh, where's my general? Oh, he's already... On the way down. 31st of May, 20... Really? June? Wow. 
August. 3rd of August. That'll work. 2nd of August, 3rd of August, same thing. Alright, kill them all. And move on, of course. Oh, he's running away. Why you run away? So yeah, let me break my alliance down here. Stupid Tibet. You thought we could be friends, but you're a theocracy and no one likes you. Oh god, Mongol nationals. I should go kill those guys. Shoot. I hate, I hate having to babysit my vassals, you know? But it's something you just gotta do. Lanzong, Pegu, and Joe. Sure. Who's going to join me? Nobody. All right. We're now at war with, well, most of Asia. Yep. All right, let's bring you guys down to here. Y'all are just going to keep on sieging. That's fine. Take you here. second general for this. In fact, yeah. Might as well. Kill the rebels. Rebels are dead. Move on. Sieges are finishing up. Good. Oh, Joe has rivaled us. Now we're talking. There you go, Joe. You can be my rival. Sean wants to be friendly. Yeah, I'm okay with that. Let's be fucking friends, baby. We do have another room for a relationship, yeah. Sure, let's marry Sean. And we do have another diplomat. Can we get Pegu out of this war? No. Who else is in the war? Lan Zong. You want to get out of the war, Lan Zong? No? Okay. Well, we'll keep an eye on them. They may want to get out of the war at some point. Uh, oh. Look at you. You juked me. He juked me. He killed my freaking... Siege team. Bastard. I'm gonna do war taxes. Money! Kill them all. Oh yeah, how much war score do we need to vassalize you? A little bit more. I guess as soon as the capital falls, he'll peace out. Or maybe after that battle. Uh, this is my sieging army. Uh, I think I might want to crush some units first. He does have 23,000 guys. Hmm. No, he actually has more than that if you count everyone, but... I wonder if I can piece you out with money. Do you like money? No. Well, he's actually interested. He just wants more than that. Well, I don't know. Uh, where's my navy? Come on down here and blockade him a bit. Put a little pressure on his economy and he might 
change his mind. So give me some mercs and move on. I'm gonna group up my armies down here and go crush this this guy. Actually, looks like he wants to go fight me in the mountains. That'd be interesting. That'd be very interesting. You want to be my vassal? Nope. You want to concede defeat? That doesn't even come close to what I want. Concede defeat. What a joke. You're a joke, Oirats. You're a joke, and your army's dead too. Oh, now he wants to be a vassal. Well, vassalizing him causes pretty much no pissy off of anyone, so... Well, how much does annexing cost? Oh, I have to siege everything. I just don't want to siege everything. It's going to take too long. Yeah, just vassalize him. Okay, let's move on. And yeah, he actually is coming for Omdo. Interesting. Probably get marriage and relations up and all that jazz. Should probably get relations back up with the Timurids again, too. They already left the coalition, but still. Oh, they're embargoing us now, you jerks. Okay, we're blockading him, but uh, we're taking attrition down here. It's too far away from our home port. Really? Fine, how about you go on patrol like this? Just keep docking up and then going back out. That works. You know what, though? Why don't we call this an episode here? Thank you guys for joining me. I've been Shen, you've been you. We just took the Oirats as a vassal. And I think we can... Can, they, can we feed them anything? Nah, we already have all their... No, it's not true. We can feed them lands over here. Excellent. We can go to war with no guy soon. Um, yeah, he doesn't really have any allies. So that works. We'll go to war with no guy, make him give these territories back to the Oirats, and then we'll annex the Oirats. Works for me, but I'll see you next time. Have a good day.